I'm Kasha Madera, and when I'm not presenting on BBC World News, I love nothing more than catching up on the latest in the arts and culture scene. So I've come here to Gdynia for the Tsurovianki Festival to tell you why I really want to make Heart of Poland, a series of short films to go out on BBC World News and bbc.com slash culture. Gdynia, along with Gdańsk and Sopot, make up the trendy Trójmiasto. It's in nearby Gdańsk where, of course, solidarity was formed, triggering the birth of a new type of Poland. 25 years on, and this country is completely transformed, fast-growing, confident, and with what I think is one of the most exciting arts and music scenes in Europe. And it is this Poland that I really want to share with a global audience. Whether it's contemporary art, exhibitions, experimental theatre, fashion, design, music of all types, it is all here. Brilliant writers, artists, directors and musicians. We'd love to cover things like the Sopot Hit Festival, a fantastically eclectic musical event set in the stunning forest backdrop of Opera Leśna. We'll be in Wrocław, named European Capital of Culture 2016. It's a medieval city brimming with galleries, with street art, some of the most exciting artists in Europe. I want to show you why Wrocław was named European Capital of Culture. Poland is famous for brilliant cinema. Łódź is at the very heart of the Polish film industry. There's also the film festival right here in Gdynia. We'll explore all of this with top directors and up and coming talent. And it's not just film, music and art, there's also fashion, there's design, there's architecture, you name it. It all comes together in things like the Malta Festival in Poznań, and artists gather from all over Europe just to perform there. So that's it, The Heart of Poland, a series to go out on BBC World News and cross-platform too on bbc.com slash culture. 25 years on since the birth of this new Poland and with Wrocław set to be European capital of culture, now is the perfect time to go out in search of the heart of Poland. Do zobaczenia.